All right, finally at four, Action News viewers are likely very familiar with our community journalist, Matteo Idanisi. We mean it when we say it's a family affair around <laughs> yeah. here. We are excited to let you know today that his brother, Nick, has joined our Action News family as well. Well, today we are sharing his first story, which focuses on a professional basketball player in Israel, bringing his passion home to Philadelphia. Yeah, so here's community journalist Nick Idanisi with the story today. Jab! Yeah! For me, it's impact over ego. I'm a believer in giving back to the community, giving back to the youth. When you're young, you don't look at, you know, race or religion. You just look at them as your friend. And I think the importance is that kids come together and learn how to work with anybody in our world. My name is Jared Armstrong. I'm a Jewish American professional basketball player who currently plays in Israel. So Jab Camps is my initial. It's Jared Armstrong Basketball Camps and Clinics throughout the summer when I'm back home in the United States. Here we go. Hustle, hustle, hustle. I'm both African American and Jewish, and I think it's important, you know, with the rich history that we have to bring the communities back together, and I think one of the best ways to do it is through sports. Go! No, come on! I think from my own experience being in camps and clinics, I've made lifelong friends, you know, that are both African American, that are both Jewish. Go work! And that's all I'm trying to bring through Jab Camps is an experience of a lifetime to have kids being able to connect with another kid, you know, that they might never ever run across. Hey, I got him! I had a lot of fun. We learned a lot. We experienced a lot. And most importantly, we gained friendships and respect for other people. How many people you know here? Zero. Zero? So now you got 10 new friends. Jab Camps is open to anybody. This is kind of just the bridge, the gap between Jewish communities, African American communities, or Caucasian communities, wherever. I just want to bridge the gap between everyone and make it a safe haven place for kids to number one, have fun, number two, compete and learn, and number three, get better at their sport. Jab Camps on three. One, two, three, Jab, jab Camps. Great group, great story, yeah. and welcome to the team, Nick. Let us know if you have any more talented siblings hanging out there at the house. <laughs>